Good day, guys. It's the fridge. Oh, blessing King, your baby. And I'm back for a special episode of Beaver Pomper. It's been a while, been a couple months. Um, I got the bottom made shirt on. It's almost time, baby. It's almost time. Anyways, Wall 601's coming up. Big announcement today. Have to have a beer for my buddy, Brandon Lemon Moeville. The match has been announced. Ryan Vector Boy Bowen against our man from Canada, Brandon Lemon Moeville. Anyways, like Ryan says, bacon, lettuce, and mayo. But we love our Canadian bacon, don't we? Brandon, you deserve this. Um, you came through so many fights in the last year. You, uh, you had a match against Louis Philippe Jean at the Abbey Bench Tournament. One of the strongest men in Canada. He weighs about 380. That took balls, brother. And then Brandon Elsessar, the guy that does one push-ups with one hand with a pretty lady on his back. The guy's uh, very strong. You took that. And then at Wall 502 CJ Twine, you took that. Uh, you've been driving around. You've been working hard. You're looking bigger. You're looking stronger. And uh, the Beaver has been supporting this match for over a year now and I think the beaver says it and Neil Pickup heard it and he made this match Wall watches Beaver Pumper podcast because I'm the man that talks and uh, Ryan Bowen uh, he's been doing good too he beat Chance of Saw Shaw Alan Kara and Wall 504 not so good at the Worlds but uh He's been doing really good. He trains with, uh, like, with Todd Zilla with the Vectors and the GOAT, John Brzezink. Now, this match is, is going to be wicked. And um, I just watched the podcast of Ryan Bowen letting Moeville know, uh, the Dr. Phil way, how to grow up in arm wrestling, what to expect, um, how to take a loss, how to do this, how to do that. And at the end, he farts out, I'm going to kick your ass. Anyways, you always hear it from me because I say it. Ryan Bowen sells himself more than Brendan does. But yet, he says that Brendan is the mouthpiece. Brendan, I find, is amazing. He's not on YouTube. He's not on Facebook shooting his mouth off. He does the work. And uh, Ryan Bowen sounded like Dr. Phil. Um, I was at a workout at Bad Companies and I watched those guys. They lose all night. They know what losing is. They put themselves in a losing position and they pull back up. Brennan knows how to lose. It's not that he's scared to lose. He needs the attitude, like the Mike Tyson attitude. You have to vision yourself winning. That's all he means by that. Anyways, great matchup. Also, on Wall 601, which is April... Oh, he wants to drink a beer? April 21st in Los Angeles. There's uh, Sheldon against the Angry Bird. Will not. Wilmot. Um, that's a great fight, too. Me and Wilmot, we got into it a bit there a couple weeks ago. It's all good now. Anyways, uh, let's mention Evan Burgoyne. And Larat, they they trained Moeville from a young boy and to what he is now. And he's prepared. He's prepared to go to war. Whoever wins this match is going to come out the winner. But whoever loses it, it doesn't mean it's over for them. Brendan made it. He's on the stage now. Ryan Bowen made it. He's on the stage. These are the two warriors. Let's get it done. All right, let's talk about the bottom eight right now. The balls are out. 
they will be at the bottom eight. Uh, Blue Diamond Bar and Grill, 6179 on Per Street, Richmond, Ontario. It will be Saturday, April 25th. Starts at 2 p.m. and it will last till 10.30 p.m. This year, there's 16 competitors. So far, the matches that are on, Juji Mufi and Larry Wills. Laba against Matthew the Titan Neck. Then there's Coach Ray against Brett the Duckfoot Burgoyne. Roger against Evan Burgoyne. Anyways, there's, uh, those are great matches. This year will be amazing. I'm expecting there's going to be maybe fist fights. Who knows? This is a wild night. Then there's Freedom Table after. Whoever wants to join that, they can come out and join the Freedom Table. Anyways... I want all you guys to come out and whoever loses this has to go against myself, the beaver. I've been training all year for this. I'm up to 175. Uh, I have legs of a 120 pound guy. My upper body is bigger and stronger than ever. And I will be at the end boss of the bottom eight. And me and my girlfriend, Jojo, We'll be singing the Canadian Anthem at the start of this event. So I'm looking forward to sing the song with Jojo, the Canadian Anthem. And I'm looking forward to anyone. You better not lose this event because the king will be there. Anyways, Ryan Bowen, BLM, BLM huge huge i'm proud of you brendan here's a beer for you and a beer for bad company my friend uh these guys are the heart of arm wrestling in canada larat um that is a crew there in ottawa and pembroke you have to see it to believe it i went there with my buddy we pulled. My buddy never even took his coat off. He goes, I'm not taking off my coat. And uh, I got my ass kicked all night, of course. Um, but when I met Mr. Mohuville, he slapped my arm like this. And he says, hold your arm like this. Slapped me around and got me in the right position. And that was uh, a bit of my training for the first bottom mate. But a year later, I'm ready, baby. Anyways, balls are out. Flip the flip, baby. It's in the straps. There's no other pooler like Canada's Devlin Rat. Come on. Balls in. Balls out. Get your balls in. Yo, balls out. I got my balls in. Yeah, I got my balls out. You don't even know what you're talking about. Flip the flip, baby. It's in the straps. There's no other pooler like Canada's Devlin Rat. Thank you till my next podcast. Hope you guys are all healthy. And I'll talk to you later. The king, baby. I'm ready.